The way it turned out was not the initial concept. In fact, the initial concept for Father Fig was to make it a kind of mid-tempo um, dance track. And what happened was that I wanted to hear something in the mix, so I cut out the snare on the, on the desk and it suddenly changed the whole mood of the track and it just had these finger clicks on it instead of having a snare pattern. And it just seemed suddenly really dreamy and this was about halfway through writing it because I was writing it as I was going along in the studio. And um, I just thought, hey, this is, you know, this is much better than, this sounds much more original than just having a mid-tempo like snare rhythm all the way through it. So I, I then worked the rest of the, the feel of the track around this kind of spacey type thing and uh, it just, it just ended up to me that being the most original sounding thing on the album. That I don't, I can't really think of anything else it sounds like, uh, which is something that, that pleases me a lot. You know, I think it's a combination of lots of different elements that work originally as a whole. You know, the initial concept for the um, video for Father Figure was nothing like the end product. It was one of those strange situations where you you shoot with a very um, very vague storyline which is not normally the way I like to do things but in this particular instance I just felt that it was uh, it was something that I wanted to get back to and also thought that it would suit the song. The other thing was that all my videos since last Christmas um, and definitely all the solo videos have just been me you know it's just me doing this and me doing that and like apart from the fact that um, although a lot of people would find it hard to believe anyone who knows me would, would actually tell you that I don't like being in front of a camera. Actually, I mean, I'm I'm perfectly happy to perform as though I'm loving every minute of it, you know. But I don't actually like being in front of the camera. So uh, to have a, a storyline which involved basically someone else and me making the occasional cameo appearance was uh, great for me. It meant I didn't have to stand there, um, you know, in front of the lens all the time.